Hi all, Susanna Baum here, and I just wanted to share three revelations that I just got following a keynote with a client that I just finished like an hour ago. Now, normally when my coaching clients come to me and they are preparing for presentations, I give them all sorts of advice. And every now and then I have occasion to take my own advice. So revelation number one, it's okay to be nervous. I was actually quite nervous for this particular client. It was a brand new client. I was using some new content. There were gonna be a lot of important people in the room. Of course, all my audiences, there's always important people in the room, but you know, this one was no different and I was quite nervous. However, what I learned was with enough preparation, with enough practice, with enough rehearsal, and by surveying certain people in the audience beforehand and even interviewing others that so that I had a chance to get to know them and understand the challenges of the room and challenges with people in the audience, that was super helpful in allowing me to reduce my nerves. The other thing that I had to remind myself was that instead of focusing on being nervous and hoping that I remembered all of the new content, I had to focus on delivering value to the audience. And if I did the preparation and the practice the right way and extensively enough, then everything would be fine. And that's what happened. Revelation number two, it is hard sometimes to read the audience's faces. So when I'm trying to be light, when I'm trying to make them laugh, when I'm trying to get a reaction and sometimes all I see are stony blank faces, sometimes it's easy to take that as sort of a miscommunication. Maybe they don't like it. Maybe they're not enjoying what I'm saying. However, what I learned afterwards is sometimes those blank faces and those stony faces are simply because they are deep in concentration and deeply focusing on what you're saying and maybe even trying to figure out a way to, to apply these new learnings into their work lives. So that's my second revelation is don't take the blank faces as representative of what they're really feeling. Because after I finished, many of them came up to me with smiling faces and great feedback of how they are going to implement some of the learnings. And revelation number three, I often tell my coaching clients, go to the washroom before uh, before you get up in front of a room, you know, check your teeth, check your hair, check your makeup, check your zippers and so on. One thing that I learned today is that when you wash your hands, beware of water spraying everywhere because it could actually spray all over your clothes and you don't want to go in front of an audience with um, wet clothes, which may also discolor. I am wearing a pink dress and uh, this pink dress uh, turned a little bit purple when it got wet. So right before my speaking, uh, before I got up in front of the room and I went to go wash my hands, I looked down, saw lots of purple splatters all over. I had to stand under the hair dryer, uh, under the air dryer for a few minutes and it went away. But beware of the water splatters. So those were my three revelations based on my keynote today. Number one, preparation and practice is so important and it's okay to be nervous, but we have to turn the nerves into excitement and turn the nerves into focusing on value for your audience. Number two is don't mistake the blank faces for them not liking you. And number three, watch out for splattering water all over your clothing. That's it for now. I'm Susanna Baum. And if ever you need any support in your upcoming presentations, let's get in touch.